All right, Shalom. All right, before I get started, <clears throat> as always, I want to give all praises due to Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh Shai, Bashim, Akakwadash, double honors to the apostles and elders, a great millstone that rule well, peace and salutation to the Ikim that's pushing his word in truth and sincerity throughout the four corners of the earth. This is the brother Zayana Ma from the GMS Detroit by Camp. Uh, coming to you another video through the spirit. All right, dealing with this. Uh, uh, Crown Royale 19, right? And um, basically, this devil is moving swiftly, you know, as the scriptures say. Um, um, basically, he's, he's moving swiftly, you know, as a lion, as a roaring lion, seeking who he may, de may devour, you know, roughly pa paraphrasing. I'll get that later, but, um, you know, according to their um, agenda, right? <clears throat> the elite's agenda, Operation Warp Speed, all right, they're basically on a schedule. And um, the end all be all is that they want everyone vaccinated, okay, at least in America, right? They want everyone vaccinated by June, right? June of 2021. So, so this rollout is coming out swiftly, all right? And um, so we're just going to get right into it. All right, this is a little article that came out earlier earlier in the week, uh, December 20th, all right? Which says, police, firefighters, teachers will be next in line for the CVID-19 vaccine, you know? Which is, uh, pretty much covers a, a lot of people, right? And, and mind you, right, you have a lot of jakes, all right, that, that have these type of positions because you know, simply put, they pay well, all right? Jake has to do something, all right, to, to make a, you know, to make a dollar, you know, to take care of his family, whatever the case may be. So you have a lot of Jakes, all right, Israelites that, that hold these positions. And um, they'll get it misconstrued that, all right, you're the target, all right? You being the so-called Negroes, Latin, and Native, Native Americans, all right, you are the target. All right, you. All right, you are the one that that's that's um deemed as a necessity as far as getting this um this max. All right, that's why you see. All right, when they when they show right in their news feeds, right, they they are they're sure to mention or show all right a so-called Negro face or a so-called let's say a minority of some sort, right? Whether it be, you know, Negro or Latin, right? Whether it be administering the shot or receiving the shot. They have to make sure, right, for the press, right? They gotta get Jake to pose for the picture, right? Because this this whole thing that's going on right now, right, is totally, right, centered around Jacob and Esau. And Esau is simply trying to, um, he wants to get rid of you, Jakes. And if he can't get rid of you, he wants to control you, all right? He wants to take you, okay, away from the Heavenly Father. And he wants to be a God over over you Negroes, Latin, and Native Americans, all right? He being a so-called white man, Esau, all right? So um, real quick, just read through some of this, right? And uh, we'll get some scriptures. Um. It says police, firefighters, teachers, and grocery workers will be among those next in line for a CVID vaccine, Maxine, let's say, a Centers for Disease Control and Prevention Advisory panel decided <coughs> Sunday. Okay. It says the committee voted 13 to 1 to recommend that phase 1B include people 75 and older and frontline essential workers all right phase 1c will include people 65 to 74 and people 16 to 64 who have high high risk medical conditions <coughs> so like it, along with other essential workers okay let's see this jump down It says right here, it says the Advisory Committee on Immunization Practices began its deliberations Sunday morning and spent the day discussing who would follow 
frontline healthcare workers and people in long-term care facilities and receiving the max. It says a second phase that could begin in February. The committee is responsible for recommending who gets uh, what vaccine, what vaccines uh, when, right? So I'm bringing this all out basically to show that Right, it's no um. <laughs> just how I said at, at the head of this video is that this devil is moving swiftly. He ain't, he ain't, he's not pulling no punches. Right, it's no more uh, of a suggestion. Right, he's at, actually implementing the agenda. All right, and like I said, he wants everything rounded up by June. Right, because again, this is pursuing. All right. To what they call Operation Warp Speed, all right, which is an agenda to vaccinate, all right, all right, all of America and really the whole world, all right, because this is considered a, a pandemic, all right, a global pandemic, and the reason is that to um, to deal with this problem, all right, they're offering this max as the solution, which which it is not a solution, all right, all right, this. If you look at, you know, the news, right, you have, it's just a lot of folly in, in, in this, right, with, with certain people that's taking the max and, um, or claiming that they took the max and, you know, you can see on brothers' channels or just certain news feeds where you can just see something that's sketchy, right, especially, um, concerning, um, the one chick, the, the nurse, all right, that fainted, all right, on live TV, all right, and they tried to clean it up, right, by saying that um, she has some kind of condition where she faints, right, at, um, I think when she feels pain, right, whatever that is, and if that be the case, <laughs> why would she be chosen as a candidate, all right, to, um, to receive the max, right? When you know she's gonna, you know, fall out, right? So that, that was just very, very um, sketchy, let's say, right? And um, quiet is kept, you know, it, it seems as though that, um, I don't know, no one can really locate, all right, this female. So, you know, who's to say what, what's really going on, what really happened, but um, just these these are things that you should pay attention to. But uh, at any rate, right, it's Operation Warp Speed, all right? Where we at here? And I'll put all this information in the uh, description box, right? <coughs> but this kind of stuck out to me right here, right? Um, you have all these different, um, uh, what would you call them, institutions, let's say, <clears throat> involved around this max. And I would have to say this is a first. You haven't seen so many different organizations, right, centered around, you know, a, a, a max, a max scene, right? But yet this one that's been rolled out in under a year, right? They so-called created this this vaccine, the so-called collusion under solution under a year, right? And you have just a lot of uh it's just a lot that's been put to it in a very short time. Put into it in a very short time. So just to name a few, right? We have the Department of Health and Human Services, right? You got the Centers for Disease Control. You have, you know, the FDA. Yeah, the National Institutes of Health, the Biomedical Advanced Research and Development Authority, right? You have the Department of Defense. You know that that should definitely raise the eyebrow, right? Why why would the Department of Defense be involved in something? Uh, that's, you know, that's a, um, 
let's say a medical condition, right? What does the military, this is basically dealing with the military, what would they have to do with something that's supposed to be handled by the medical field, right? It's simply put because this is a biological weapon, right? All right, there's been many stories coming out, all right, that they're trying to cover up to say or not say that, you know, there's any side effects or, you know, they're just trying to downplay everything. They're trying to water everything down as if it's not a big deal, right? And, you know, if you've been, <laughs> if you, shit, you've been around or not even around, but I'll just say it this way, okay, every every um medicine all right that the that the medical industry officers offers all right comes with a um, side effect of some sort each and every one right and they boldly tell you all right in their commercials all right or some small print or you know you ask the doctor right there's going to be some type of all right, side effect. So why would this vaccine be any different, right? So it, moreover, why would you take it, all right? Given, all right, the time that it took for them to produce this, all right? You know, and um, moreover, the things that's inside the mask, you know, which that's a whole another conversation. But hey, as the scriptures say, never trust thy enemy, all right? And this, this video is simply for, all right, you Israelites, all right? Now, we know that only, okay, one-third, all right, which is the 144,000, all right, and the, and the, um, the one-third of Israel is going to, all right, receive, or not, should I say not receive, but receive this message, all right? They're, they're the ones that's going to, all right, um, not take this mask and moreover not take the chip all right because that's what this is all leading up to right this whole formula all right they're going to roll out the same formula when it comes to the the rfid chip all right the mark of the beast they're going to do it in phases most likely all right but um again you have all these different institutions all right that's involved all right in this this agenda you know so, to say the least, they're taking it seriously, you know? And um, it's getting to a point where they're not asking, you know? So, uh, let's see, going back. Let's see what I can... I wanted to show this here. Right, this is dealing with the different phases. All right, it says, when can I get a CV-19 vaccine right well this is for the state of Massachusetts but like I say this is a statewide deal or should I say nationwide deal alright I'll put this in the description box as well but um but you can see the schedule right phase one December to February all right, phase two from February to April, and phase three, right, April to June, you know. And when you look at phase three, it's saying vaccine available, all right, to the general public. So everyone outside, all right, the so-called essential workers, all right, let's get that. All right. Which are all these different industries here, all right? First responders, all right, such as firefighters, police, teachers, support staff, all right, daycare workers, all right, food and agri agri agriculture, all right, manufacturing, correction workers, U.S. Postal Service workers, public transit, grocery stores. So, like, they're covering literally everything. And, like I say, um, you have a lot of jakes, all right, that hold all these different positions, you know. So they're not leaving no stone unturned, so to say. So <laughs> it's it's you're at the point where you have to make a decision and stand on that, right? Because um, 
if not, right, you're pretty much going to be, not even pretty much, you're going to be um, looked at as, you know, as as the problem, you know. They're going to point the finger at you, all right, for not taking the max. And you got to be able to deal with, with that decision. And the only way you can deal with that, all right, is being rooted in this word, all right being rooted in the spirit because there ain't no man that's going to be able to save you out of this scenario alright we, we solely at the point where we have to depend alright exclusively on Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai and nothing else you know regardless of what anybody got to say alright because your church alright they're going to they're gonna push it alright you're going to push it as something to your benefit all right, something you should just do and get it over with. All right, you got false um, prophets out here. All right, that's going to speak the same and have been speaking the same. You know, as, as you know, speaking as if it, uh, you know you're a coward. You're scared. All right, if you don't get the match, well, this ain't a time to show. All right, not in that sense. This is not a time to show. That you macho or you tough, all right, by way of getting this vaccine, all right, that ain't, that ain't proven shit, you know, what does what that prove, that don't prove, that proves you, you a fool, that's what it proves, you know, that proves you don't have any wisdom, right, because history shows that you shouldn't trust this devil, so, um, that's pretty much all on that, you know, I'll put these links in the description box, I just want to get a few scriptures real quick. All right, one I had quoted. This is um, 1 Peter's 5 and 8. It says, be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, as a roaring lion, walketh about seeking whom he may devour. All right? And this devil, all right, being a so-called white man, Esau, Edom, is looking to destroy, to devour, all right, you you so-called Negroes, Latins, and Native Americans out there by way of this, all right, this Maxine, and then fast forwarding, all right, to the mark of the beast, all right? All these things are already in place, all right? They're just, they're just rolling it out now, all right? And we've been talking about these things and warning, right, the people for a very long time, all right? From the apostles and elders on down from some 30-odd years, all right? Warning you that this day would come. Well, now it's here. All right? There ain't no way you can run to refuge or hide or whatnot. This ain't nothing you can circumvent. All right? You're going to have to take this head on. Like I say, you're going to have to make a decision and say, no, I'm not taking that damn max. You know? It's not worth, all right, your, your soul. It's not worth, all right? We, we don't fear men, all right? We fear, a. Hey, we fear Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, period, all right? Um, another scripture I want to get, I think it was, uh, let me check. I think that's 1 Thessalonians 5. Is it 5? Okay. This is First Thessalonians five, and I'm gonna start at I start at verse six. It says, "Therefore, let us not sleep." as do others but let us watch and be sober you know because this is a time all right we got to stay in the spirit we got to stay on point you know we got to hey we got to st stay on watch all right you know if, if you have any type in uh type of um you know it's just if you're in the spirit if you're in the right spirit all right Right, you wouldn't be caught up in these dumbass holidays, right? 
anniversaries, birthdays of any sort. You know, this ain't the time to be partying and bullshit. You know, it's not a, hey, this place is a place of captivity. All right, it's nothing, okay? It's nothing to celebrate, all right? At this time, we're in a time of war right now, all right? And this devil, hey, he's he's on high alert and he's 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 in attack mode, you know. Um, it says, uh, for they that sleep, sleep in the night, and they that be drunken are drunken in the night. Kind, you know, when you sleep, you sleep at night, you don't know what's going on, right? Nine times in ten, you dreaming, you know? You rolling over, you slobbing, you know? You like, you dead sleep. And that's the uh, spirit that a two-thirds of our people are in, you know? They're in a deep sleep. They're in a slumber, right? To the point they don't know what's going on. They're just totally unaware, right? Now, you have some jakes that know and consider, but um, it's not quite enough Right, they're they're not they're not really taking this thing serious. They just saying, you know, oh, I'm not gonna do this. I'm not gonna do that. Well, you don't know, okay? You don't truly know what you're gonna do at that moment. You know, it's easy to say it now, but if you're not rooted in this word, right, you ain't gonna really have nothing to stand on. You know, you you're not gonna really understand what's what's at stake. You know what I mean? You're not going to know, like, okay, this is regarding my soul. You know what I'm saying? Because, all right, it, there's there's commandment, there's laws, okay, against, all right, uh, making cuttings in the flesh, all right, pricking the skin, this and that, and the third, all right? We're not supposed to do those things, all right? That, that's for the heathen, all right? And the other nations, they can take the shot, do what they want to do, all right? At the same breath, we we know, all right, two-thirds of our people going to do what they want to do because they stuck in their ways, you know, simply put. So it is what it is. This is just simply a warning, you know, a warning of many warnings. Just, hey, so there is no excuse, all right? But read Noah says, uh, but let us who are of the day be sober, putting on the breastplate, of faith and love and for a helmet the hope of salvation for the most high have not appointed us to wrath but obtain but to obtain salvation by our Lord Yahweh Shai Mashiach okay. so we, we know we have confidence all right in our power we know we have a all right we, we have a um a contingency plan, if you will, right? We have an exit plan, right? And it's rooted in faith, you know? It's, it's, it's crazy as that may seem, right, to the average American, right? Because it doesn't seem like we're doing nothing active, right? It's not nothing they can see, like, oh, well, well what you going? You, you're not taking the mats. You know, you have dumb people that ask you, right, and, and want to debate, on why you should and shouldn't, well, why you should, should I say. And um, it just thing, at the end of the day, it comes down to belief, right? So we have reason to believe. The hopeful elect has reason to believe. They have reason to hope and have faith because we got the scriptures. We know what the scriptures say, all right? We got the whole playbook. We know how this thing ends, you know? So, hey, we just have to endure, you know. This this is part of our affliction. This is part of our, our, our test, our trial, you know. And Lord willing, we get through it. So, hey, with that, you know, I want to give all praises due to Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rekakudash. Do honors to the apostles and elders, a great millstone that we will. Peace and salutations to the icon that's pushing this word in truthful sincerity throughout the four corners of the earth. Shut up.